listeners, set. All right, that is just moments ago when runners took off for that first ever Youngstown Marathon. A lot of runners out there. I know they had close to a thousand people sign up to run that race. So a great start so far. Yeah, and mm -hmm. it's going to be good conditions to start off with. Mm -hmm. Also, we're tracking some rain. Hey, good morning, everyone. I'm meteorologist Matt Jones. Alex has the day off. Yeah, and I'm Abby Schrader, so we're hanging out with uh, you this morning. This yep. weekend, it's been great because there's been so much going on. Uh, of course, the marathon is the big thing. And then also yesterday, the champion high school baseball and softball teams both bringing home state championships. Right. Congratulations, mm -hmm. Tiffany. Yeah. It's a huge win. Definitely. A lot of good stuff going on. But again, back to that marathon. Hopefully, for the end of the race in the next couple hours, that rain will hold off. Right, we are tracking a few showers. It's mm -hmm. going to be spotty hit or miss, but also it's going to be light showers. So as Rich was telling me earlier, runners tend to like the conditions, and we'll go through all of that in our full, full forecast. But also, Christina's out there live right now. Yeah, we're going to check in with her right now and uh, see how it's looking out there. Hey, Christina. We are standing at the finish line of the first ever Youngstown Marathon, and runners are about a half hour into their 26.2 marathon run. And the 5K kicked off 15 minutes ago at 7:15 for that 13.1 mile run. And we're here with the girl who started it out, Courtney Poulis. Good morning. Good morning. A lot of work to put on the first ever Youngstown Marathon. What's it like to see all your hard work pay off? I think it's kind of indescribable, honestly, to see everything we've done over the last six to eight months finally just go you know how many runners did you have out here this morning I think we had over 1200 1200 mm -hmm. and they're in the race right now what's gonna be happening in just about you said 10 minutes when the first person comes back from the 5k 5k started at 715 the fastest runners will finish between 15 and 20 minutes so they'll be coming through before we know it and those marathoners they have a little bit of a ways to go what time do you expect the first person to be back from that I would say about 225 230 and you've got to talk to a lot of these runners. What are they saying leading up to it? They're excited this is here. A lot of people are excited that we're finally doing this in Youngstown. So, And it's the first one. First one. Awesome. Thank you so much, Courtney. And I got a chance to talk to some runners before they laced up their shoes and headed out for the marathon. They said that they were nervous, and it's all about diet, the stuff you eat. The day before the race, they said they've been loading up on carbs. And a guy even had a waistband on with uh, fuel for him to get through. He had Powerade with him and a lot of other things, proteins, to get him through the race. And I even got to see Rich Morgan. He's out here running the 5K, so a whole lot of fun. We'll be out here all morning long for the first ever Youngstown Marathon. Reporting live from Youngstown, I'm Christina Mullen, WKBN 27 First News, Sunday morning.